Hi everyone, I am Marseille from Bark and Bramble and hard to believe but today is November 1st and Gigi's puppies are now 21 days old which makes them three weeks. They are getting so big and so adorably cute. So without further ado, I'm just going to show you the different puppies. I'm not going to go in any particular order because at this point they're just all kind of walking around on the whelping box and having a great time. I have Jingle here. He's a male and he is our big guy weighing in at almost um, three pounds, 2.9 to be exact. Um, and then I have Miss Holly here. She's a female, of course. And look at her. I love her white little paws, her chest and her little chin. She's a love bug. But they all are, to be honest. Um, and then I have Dickens. He's a male. He's also so cute. Oh, you're trying to get away. They don't want to be held right now because they've decided, you know what? It's a lot more fun to walk around than to be held. I don't blame them. Um, then I have Mary. Mary has really gotten big. Look at her little white chin. Got white hair. Oh, yes. She's just gotten so cute. Yeah, hi. And we have Tinsel. She's a female. She's also one of my big chunkers. Um, I think she's 2.7 pounds now. Yeah, she's a darling. Oh, are you gonna show him your big smile with your yawn? Yeah. Um, we have, who am I missing here? Nutmeg. Yes. Hi. Yo, she's got the white right here. She's like, hello. I would love to give you a hug and a kiss. <laughs> um, did I miss anyone? Did, oh, Tiny. Did I give Tiny Tim? I don't think I did. Look at him, he's adorable, aren't you, bub? Mm. Yes, he's so cute in his little behind. Yes. Um, I think we got everybody. Um, so for today's novelty item, um, this is kind of funny and just very everyday, but all of my puppies love this and I repeat this item a lot. It is baby wipes. They love the box of baby wipes because it makes such this crinkly noise. They will just like play and explore and sniff and climb all over it for a long time. So I usually just add it in maybe once a week to other toys because they, as they get older, they really like to play and try to make that crinkly noise. Um, kind of interesting. Um, we do our gentling exercises every day. Um, so I'll go over it again in case you um, aren't familiar. So we do, we always start with their ears and we're always gentle. We're not trying to, um, you know, make them uncomfortable or anything like that. Then I will cover their eyes. We touch their little nose. Right now we go in their mouth. Um, and I'm particularly looking for teeth. I haven't felt any. When we feel teeth, um, we can start baby mush. Um, but this is great for if they go to the vet, you want somebody to be able to go in their mouth without them um, biting you. And then we gently massage each of their paws. And as we go on in the weeks, we add a little bit more pressure. Again, not to make it painful, just to so that they can get used to the touch. We go down the back of their spine. We let them feel their tail. I go underneath their collar because we're going to be touching collars a lot when we put on a leash. So that is an important skill. And then the last thing we do is we let them we rub their belly. So I try to flip them. Sometimes they like it, sometimes they don't. This little guy, Tiny Tim, he seems totally fine with it. And um, we just kind of massage around. Now, 
Before I let him go, I put him close to my heart. I want him to feel safe. I want him to feel loved. Um, having a heartbeat right next to you is very comforting. And we just kind of give that, um, think about somebody who has anxiety and you wear like the thunder shirts or you have the weighted vest. This is very secure to puppies. And when he is settled, I can put him down and we're all done. And I do that with each one of our puppies. Um, yeah, it does take some time and I'm okay with that. We enjoy each and every one of these puppies. I can tell you, you know, as they get older, I can tell you everything about their personality and their little quirks. And um, I absolutely take great pride in, in knowing that I know my puppies. Um, so I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday. We do have room on Gigi's Litter. So if you are interested, please go to our website at BarkinBramble.com. Um, feel free to message me. I will get back to you. Um, my husband, Doug, will also answer any questions that you have. Um, and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye-bye.